A Tulsa man serving a 30-year prison sentence for murdering an Oklahoma sheriff finds a way to post some surprising photos on Facebook. Fox 23 News found pictures of 32-year-old Justin Walker posing in his prison cell. Walker was convicted of killing Pawnee County Sheriff Dwight Woodrell Jr. in 2001. Abby Alford looked into the Facebook postings that fly in the face of the law only on Fox 23, Abby. Well, Shara, it's a felony to have a cell phone in a prison, but you can't tell that by looking at Justin Walker's Facebook page. He's known as Justin Walk on Facebook. He's a known gang member of the Aryan Brotherhood, and he's not shy about posing with his cellmates. What? Wow. Hold on. Sure this is real. It's very real. What? Convicted murderer Justin Walker shows himself smoking what appears to be a homemade bong inside a cell at the Granite Reformatory, a medium security facility. Smoking a bong? Yeah, yeah. he's in a bong. In jail. In wow. prison. In prison. Walker posts more photos from his bunk, apparently smoking a joint, then holding a bottle of booze and a bag of weed with another man. Pound, dude. Weed. Wow. Bags of it, dude. That's in prison. They're living it up in there. As we show folks on the street, it causes a lot of concern. Show 50 people in every room. Right she showed pounds of weed and alcohol really? and yeah. all his homeboys in there. Yeah. But then the photos from a cell get more disturbing. I got something in his hand, a knife. It's a shank and he's licking it. What? Yeah, that's what he was holding while going that last picture. That's wow. crazy. Facebook shows he started posting pictures in November. Walker added pictures of his daughter even posing with these guns. You are kidding. What, what type of image are you setting for, you know, like these kids that's on Facebook? Yeah, and you got somebody that's inside the institution that's loose like that? Facebook shows the pictures are uploaded from a cell phone. And right here on his Facebook page is a picture of him holding one. That's iPhone. No, that's I a, think it's a black Blackberry. The Department of Correction says it's a felony to have a cell phone in a correctional facility and they aggressively investigate cases where inmates have smuggled in contraband. I've heard they throw that stuff over the fence to them. Or smuggle phones and drugs hidden on and in their body. This is wild. I don't get it. <laughs> I mean, this is Holy prison. Holy cow. What's now, since I reported Walker's Facebook page to the Department of Corrections earlier today, the Granite Reformatory would only tell me action will be taken tonight. Although, just before 5 o'clock, Walker did post on his Facebook, quote, just chillin'. It's count time, smoking a cig, thinking about today's events. I'm Abby Alford. Fox 23 News. All right, Abby, thank you very much. Now, the Department of Corrections says it's up to the district attorney in Greer County, where the Granite uh, City Prison is, to file charges. Walker could spend more time in prison. Right now, federal officials are working on a law that would allow them to install a jamming system to ban inmates from using cell phones.